Development Agency offices in Akuru as embattled CEO Samuel Uruma attempted to block the board members from handing him a letter communicating his suspension. Razian Kitani now files an altercation ensued, taking the invest in intervention rather of police from Cap Tempo to restore order with Oruma pleading his innocence. Friday afternoon. And I'm going for it. And drama ensued at the Central Rift Water Works Development Agency offices after the chief executive officer Samuel Oruma, despite signing his compulsory leave later, remained adamant that he was still in office, insisting that his house was politically motivated. My office, I'm still in office. <laughs> I don't have a problem. What the investigation if I need But I need protection from the board chair, Mr. Samuel Andiritu, while noting that the matter was still under investigations, hinted that specifications into the contract might have been chained with the rumor's consent with an aim of siphoning funds while announcing the appointment of Douglas Murray as the acting CEO. Water and Sanitation Project. Uh, it has been uh, arranged that there has been some procurement irregularities and uh, some technical variation of the project or uh, of the project materials and uh, there were complaints anonymous complaints uh, that prompted the EACC uh, to start investigations an isolated figure <laughs> and despite employees walking away, rumor remained steadfast, admitting that investigations were ongoing while pleading his innocence. All this is all about politics going around because maybe some quarters are not comfortable that the CEO in this in this institution. It's not supposed to be the one in that office. The embattled CEO now says the tendering process of the project in question was done during his predecessor's reign. Well, raising questions on his removal from office. There is no money lost in Bomet Mulot. The investigation being undertaken is about tender documents. and all that dental tendering process which was done by my predecessor not in the room